Welcome to our deep dive into Fedora 42 Beta, the latest test release from the Fedora project that's already generating a lot of buzz in the Linux community. In this video, we're going to explore the key features, major improvements, and what you can expect from this exciting beta release. Section 1. Overview and Additions Fedora 42 Beta is available for public testing, and it marks a significant step forward in the evolution of the Fedora Linux ecosystem. Whether you're a developer, system administrator, or an everyday Linux enthusiast, this release has something for you. One of the standout changes is the promotion of the KDE Plasma desktop to full edition status. This means that alongside the flagship Fedora workstation, which now sports the upcoming GNOME 48 desktop, KDE users enjoy the same level of support and polish. Additionally, Fedora introduces the new Cosmic Spin, a Rust-based desktop environment developed by System76 that brings unique window management and customization features to the table. For users on Apple Silicon Macs, Fedora Asahi Remix 42 Beta is now available. This variant incorporates all Fedora 42 changes and adds built-in FEX emulation making it easier to run x86 and x86-64 binaries on Apple hardware. Section 2. New Installer Experience A major highlight of Fedora 42 Beta is the overhauled Anaconda installer. Now available as a native Wayland application, the installer no longer relies on legacy x11, which results in more consistent keyboard control and a smoother overall experience. The introduction of a web-based UI for partitioning is another game-changer. This new feature guides users through disk setup with options for guided partitioning, dual-boot installations, and even an easy reinstall Fedora option, ensuring that even newcomers can complete installations with confidence. Section 3. System Enhancements and Updated Packages under the hood, Fedora 42 Beta is packed with updates and improvements designed to boost both performance and security. Key improvements include kernel and core technologies. The beta ships with a modern Linux kernel expected to be beyond 6.13, with some reports mentioning early 6.14 builds, offering enhanced hardware support and performance optimizations. Package updates. Fedora 42. Beta features Ruby 3.4, delivering new language improvements, alongside updates to Python Setup Tools 74+, Golang 1.24, and TCL TK 9.0. The transition to DNF5 as the default package manager means faster and more efficient software management. File System and Installer Changes Fedora is shifting its live media format from SquashFS to EROFS, which is anticipated to speed up boot times and improve overall efficiency. Security and Performance New RPM copy-on-write features help reduce I.O. load during installations, and automatic removal of expired repository keys via DNF5 enhances security while keeping the system lean. Section 4. Community Testing and Feedback as with every beta release, Fedora 42 is still undergoing rigorous testing. The Fedora project invites users to download the beta from the official website and provide feedback through their testing channels, mailing lists, or discussion forums. Your input is crucial. It helps identify any remaining blocker bugs and ensures that the final release is as robust and user-friendly as possible. Conclusion Final Thoughts Fedora 42 Beta represents a major milestone for the Fedora project, showcasing significant updates across the board, from a reimagined installation experience to improved system performance and broader hardware support. Whether you're a fan of GNOME, KDE, or even curious about the new Cosmic Spin, there's never been a better time to explore what Fedora has to offer. If you enjoyed this overview and want to stay updated on the latest developments, be sure to subscribe and leave your comments down below. Thanks for watching and happy testing with Fedora 42 Beta.